man, there's something about being in an empty department store that just makes me want to run around. Holy whoa! Rizette? The real Rizette? Seriously? And who are you? I'm the guy who's gonna save you! Don't you fear, now I'm here! And you are? After what you've done to the town and how you've been protecting a fake, you must be the culprit. The what now? Don't play dumb. You did such horrible things to Labrys, and now you've gotten Matsuro-san and the others. Put this town back to normal, at once! Wait, there's a misunderstanding. Something's not right here. We need to talk this over. Please, won't you help me? That scary girl is picking on me. She's so mean. Huh? Okay, she looks scary, but she doesn't look like a bad person. Actually, she's kind of cute. If you won't come, then I'll make the first move. Go Konohana Sakia! Persona! Like I was saying, can you wait a sec? Why are you doing this? Violence isn't the answer, you know. Don't waste your breath! I will protect my friends and my town! <gasps> Whoa! Ugh, what a pain! What are you, stupid or something? are you gonna keep up this stupid charade? Cheap sob stories don't bring in the ratings these days. What use are friends, anyway? What? That's not true. I try harder because of my friends. They make me stronger. They give me people to live up to and people to protect. And if you deny that strength, then I cannot lose against you. Me sick. Hey, aren't you supposed to be on my side? Hurry up and deal with her. Uh, um. <sighs> no. Hey, say something, you baseball freak. Sorry. Huh? I can't do anything on my own. And people have been helping me all the time until now, too. But because I can't do anything by myself, I want to stay strong for someone else. That's why, even if you're the real Rosette, I can't side with you. Pfft, what's with these cheap cliches? Take a look in the mirror before you say stuff like that. Oh well, I guess it's fine. It would have been more fun if the two of you actually went at it. But I'll, I'll invite, invite you both, both to my last concert, concert before, before the world ends. ends. Now, bring on the ring! Um, you're not the culprit? I'm Junpei Iori, 
the nuclear warhead of the Shadow Operative missile. I'm sorry I doubted you. The Shadow Operatives? You mean Mitsuru-san? Yep, that's right. Can you stand back a little? It hardly counts as an apology, but I'll take care of this for you. Holy crap. Man, that was tough. <sighs> Thank you, Junpei-san. I'm Yukiko Imagi. Yukiko-san, huh? Are you a high schooler from around here? Uh, can I ask you something? Huh? Are you hitting on me? What? C come on, really? I, I just want to know what's going on in this town. I'm sorry. I, I get caught up with weird people too often. I mean, you've got a beard and a baseball bat. Come on, you're treating me more like a criminal suspect than a dude who's hitting on you. I'm not a bad guy, okay? But I can see how you get caught up in situations like that. I mean, you are cute. When it happens, use the Junpei-style stranger danger technique. The Junpei style? Oh, is that like Hanayagi style? Uh, something like that. I teach kids baseball, and I also teach them basic self-defense from suspicious people. Stranger danger technique number one. First, you have to yell really loud. Always start by yelling for help. Huh, okay. Pervert! Uh, what? Like that? Y yeah, that was pretty promising. Huh? Yukiko-senpai, get away from him! Himiko! Get away from her, you perv! Holy crap, that was close! This is a misunderstanding, Rizet. A misunderstanding! Hold on, Risei-chan. He has a beard, but he's not a creep. Huh? I I'm so sorry. I thought Yukiko-senpai was screaming because she was being assaulted. But I'm glad you're okay. I figured that if I came to the food court, there'd be someone else here. I'm glad you're okay too, Risei-chan. And it looks like you can use your persona to fight now? That's amazing! So, this is Junpei Iori. He's supposedly a nuclear landmine for the Shadow Operatives. Oh, so you're one of Mitsuru-san's team. I'm Risei Kujikawa. It's nice to meet you. You too. Just call me Junpei. And that's supposed to be nuclear warhead, okay? So, um, why are you here, Junpei-san? Are you on duty? Well, I, uh, kinda overslept. And then I found out that Mitsuru-senpai and the others are missing, and this town's been turned into this... Huh? Mitsuru-san and the others are missing? Are they okay? Well, the Midnight Channel came on again, and General Teddy said there'd be another tournament. It seems that's where they're being held. Huh? What's the Midnight Channel? It sounds kind of like an adult-rated cable show. They've already been captured? We've got to hurry and save them! Hold on, I'll try searching for them. Oh, but I think I know where they are. They're probably over where our school is on the hill. Tartarus? Junpei-san, is anybody else from the Shadow Operatives here, too? Huh? Oh, yeah, I, I think so. Maybe? Uh... Hmm? Are you really a member of the Shadow Operatives? You seem... fishy. Maybe he's a fake after all. No, 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 I'm, I'm real. Look, all of us have a badge, like this. Huh.
Um, well, give me a sec. Himiko, search mode! I have four readings heading towards Yasugami High and that tower. I think one of them is Labrys, but I don't know about the other three. Huh? Labrys is here too? Mm-hmm. I can't communicate with her because the interference is so bad, but I'm pretty sure. And those other readings aren't shadows, right? They feel like Persona users. One of them is strangely small, though. Uh, it's probably Koromaru. He's a dog. A dog? A dog can use a Persona? How? Uh, I don't know. He just can. Junpei-san, you seem... pretty vague about everything. Oh, there's someone near here! Naoto-kun! And Kanji? Kanji's reading is pretty weak, though. He might be injured. You can't communicate with them, right? If they're close, then should we go directly there to help them out? Yeah, but then we're putting a hold on rescuing Mitsuru-san and her team, aren't we? Right. So you two should hurry to where this Kanji-kun is. I'll keep heading to that tower. Based on what you said before, it sounds like my comrades are going that way after all. Okay. Oh, but... Oh, right. That would leave you two girls alone. Do you want me to go with you? I mean, if you really want me, I'll do it. Junpei-san, are you going to be okay on your own? Are you sure you won't get lost? The town's turned into something like a maze. I'll be fine. Maybe I don't look it, but I've got experience with stuff like this. Oh, okay. We'll go meet up with the others before heading to that tower. Please be careful, Junpei-san. <laughs> <laughs>